I really need to restrain myself sometimes because I'm sure one of these days it's going to get me into trouble. There was uh, an article uh, on another app about Angela Rayner wearing £70 shoes, making it very obvious that the person who wrote that article hadn't actually bought their own clothes for a long time if they thought 70 quid was something to notice. And... The number of people commenting on her appearance and her clothing. OK, you don't have to like it, but she was wearing a trouser suit and she was wearing a pair of comfortable shoes and whatever, I think she looked perfectly fine. But the number of women making absolutely vile comments about her appearance was really astounding. 2024. So, of course, I salted my way through. I wandered through all of the women in the line that were doing it. And the men too, to be fair, but very much the women. And had a look at what they looked like. And they were almost exclusively older women. So I made a comment to criticise their appearance as well. Because if you can dish it out, you ought to be able to take it. Seems they can't, in fact, take it. And the number of them that just did not understand the problem, just didn't, thought it was totally unreasonable that I would make some comment about them and it was some deep reflection on my personality. I thought I should comment on their taste in hats or their cheap and nasty blouse or, you know, their overbli... Or, so upset about it. No idea of the irony and I really need to stop doing that. But honestly, if you... If you're prepared to spout that stuff on social media about another woman that you don't know, be prepared to get it back. 